Oh, I... Welcome back, everyone, to Heavy Rain! Um, so I have the slightest idea... Wait, why am I controlling this guy? Holy crap! <laughs> Did you see the friggin' weight? Like, the car almost just, like, flipped there. Jeez, buddy. So who is this? And where am I? Unless this is like... Okay, let's see. Been looking for weeks. Hope I hit pay dirt this time. Hit what? Men at the desk gotta be able to help. Yeah, well, we shall see if there is even anyone here. Lauren Winter. Ring any bells? Nope, can't say it does. But, yeah, welcome back, everyone. <laughs> it's... Oh, that Lauren Winter. Third oh. floor, last door on the left at the end of the corridor. So, I'm just going to let you guys know that there may be some issues with this. If the series does end, it's because I, can, I am continuously getting copyright strikes. I've had a company uh, attack my first episode for, for whatever reason. Apparently, they're gong, and they own some visual effect i've never heard of gong but just to let you guys know that if i continue do running into these problems i unfortunately will have to put an end to the series but if if that does happen what i'll do is i'll stream the rest of it and uh hopefully that'll be it but uh i'm not gonna dwell on it too much let's just let's just hope it doesn't happen and let's let's continue on here so we're gonna go up into the third floor and see what the heck we who this lauren person is Okay, let's see. I'm gonna take a wild guess. Cause he didn't say the number, did he? Is it this one? Let's see this one. Lauren! Lauren Winter? <gasps> Sorry, I only see clients by appointment. Hey. Wait. None of that. Don't be rude. Oh, I see what it it's is. It's 50 bucks. I don't kiss and I don't do any weird shit. Fine by me. Awkward. I. Uh, who is this guy? Am I a cop? Like I have no idea what's going on. Money on the table. You got exactly ten minutes when the alarm rings. It's over. Okay. I. I don't want to have sex with you. Not at all. Okay. No. Walk. Oh my God. This walking sometimes is really funky. Okay. No. Come. come. Oh, buddy. There we go. Fifty bucks. Okay, so now what the heck do we do? Do we just have some fun? You should take your clothes off. We ain't got all day. Actually, I'm not a customer. Oh, shit, a cop. I should have known. What you want? A freebie? Is that it? <laughs> no. My name is Scott Shelby. I'm a private detective. The families of the victims of the origami killer asked me to investigate the murders. I came here just to ask you some questions about Johnny. I already told the police all I know and have nothing to add. Leave me alone. Okay. Well, we're gonna persist. There'll be other victims if we don't stop the killer. You have got to help me, Lauren. Yeah, otherwise the blood you will be on your head. can aid the investigation. You don't want that. Help you? There's nothing you can do. My son's dead. Do you oh, hear shit. me? Oh shit! She is He's a victim. Dead. Oh, man, I'm sorry. I understand, Lauren. I know what you're going through. With your help, we can oh, yeah? take this fudger you know what it down. You like to find your own son's body on a wasteland? I'm sorry. I don't believe you have the slightest idea what I'm going through, Mr. Shelby. Okay. Um, well, what kind of trick are we going to do? <laughs> like, If we don't find the killer, there'll be other mothers who find their son's body on a deserted wasteland. But, but, but you're right. Why should you care? It's not your problem anymore, right? You're not gonna care, are you? Look at yourself. Would your son love you for what you're doing right now? Would you want to know? There we go. Um. Let's, like, who's Johnny? So let's find out about Johnny first. Questions? No, no, no. 
Tell me about Johnny. What kind of kid was he? Johnny was really a good boy. Sometimes he fought with other kids who called me a kiddo. In his own way, I think he understood what was going on. Why am I like tearing at the back of my freaking head there? Uh, let's see. Let's ask about Johnny's Did home. Johnny live with you? Yes. Of course, I made sure he never met any of my clients. I wanted to stop, you know. But we needed the money. I was trying to earn enough to get us out of here. Hmm. Stop scratching your head. You want one? Absolutely. No, quit. no, take one. That's brave. Oh, I could. I didn't know I could walk. Let's take a little. Oh. Oh, damn. This is all awkward now that I'm just staring here. Did you suspect anyone after he disappeared? I meet a lot of pretty shady characters in my line of work. Yeah, that'd be sure, hard I to thought of it at first. determine who it was, especially, like you said, in her line of work. But it didn't seem to make any sense. I don't believe any of my clients could have done that to my Johnny and all those other kids. God damn it. <laughs> it's so gross. I'm sorry for being about really about immature. A loser without a job who liked to beat me after a few drinks. That's not cool. He left the day Johnny disappeared. I ain't seen him since. Coward. Good thing he left. Oh. Is that a client or is that the alarm? Oh, it's the alarm. Time's up, Mr. Shelby. I hope you got what you wanted. Now get out of here. See, I'm wondering what would have happened if I didn't ask any questions. Would have... Would have I been kicked out regardless? I guess we should leave. Or can we talk to her? Console her? Or should we just like... Oh, what was that? What is this? Yeah, this isn't creepy. Let's just, just stay here even though we're told to leave. Alright, big guy. Let's go. Let's go. Let's see if we can actually see anything in our apartment first. Or could we pay more? Well, if you remember anything, the smallest detail, give me a call. Scott Shelby. Okay, well, I guess she doesn't want to see any more of me, so let's just bounce, I guess. Or could we go in here? Could we go in her? No? You're not going to go in? Oh, that's lame. I want to go in the bathroom. Let me go in the bathroom. Okay, how do we leave? Where do we go? Oh, okay, there we go. Should have checked the camera. <laughs> what the fuck is going on? I don't understand this. Oh, I have asthma? Okay. That was really creepy. Oh, who the hell? Oh, that's another client. Lauren. <sighs> Lauren, open up, baby. It's me. Troy, what are you doing here? I already told you I don't want to see you anymore. Hey. Sorry, Dal. But I really want Whoa, to see you. Whoa, buddy. That ain't cool. Dude, break in. What do you want, asshole? The fuck's Lauren. your problem? Is everything all right? She's just swell. Now beat it, loser. Now fuck that. Fuck that. We're getting in. You again? If you're looking for trouble, you found it. Oh, buddy, this is gonna suck. Oh, damn it! There we go. Okay. Okay. There we go. Suck it, you asshole. No, I, I keep messing up. X. Jesus. Uh-uh. Not like this, my friend. Not like this. 
Oh, you son of a oh, bitch! Damn it! No, no! Come on! Ah, oh, crap! I'm probably gonna get hurt here! Okay, okay. Yeah! Suck on that, you friggin' bald freak! Oh, God. No, 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 no! Oh, God. Oh, God. Come on! X! Jesus, I don't like this! Oh, come on! I got this! I'm on a streak! Oh my fig! You serious? Oh, there you go, baby. Yes, suck on that punch, baby. Oh! I'll see you again, asshole. That's right. You, you continue walking, my friend. Are you all right? Better than him, I guess. Who is he? An ex-client who thinks he owns me. He was getting violent, and I told him I didn't want to see him anymore. Well, you should be careful. He'll probably be back. Sorry about the mess. Mr. Shelby? Yeah. Thanks. You're more than welcome, miss. Oh. That was intense. Yeah, you know what's really confusing me? Is I'm used to like A, B, X, and Y, not like X, circle, square, and triangle, so... It's been a while since I've, I've played on a PlayStation. See, is that inches of rain at the bottom? It's like 0 0.680 inches. I assume it's rain. Whoa. What the hell is that? Who is this now? See, I don't get it. Am I taking on many, many roles of, like, different people here? Or what? I, I Am I a cop? The zone is sectioned off, sir. Please step back. Agent Norman Jaden, FBI. You got a badge or something, Mr. Jaden? Yeah. Yeah, of course. Let's grab it then. Here you go. Check. You can pass. See, now I'm curious as to what the heck I was holding. Because that blue vial looked like something of importance. Wait, wait. Blake? Like, why do I? Okay, why do? You... I'm looking for Lieutenant Blake. Is he around? I saw him arrive earlier. He's here somewhere. Thanks. Man, he's a very soft-spoken dude. Kind of creepy. Okay, so I assume it's over here that we're probably gonna have to go check out, right? Oh damn! Now I'm looking good! Okay, what the heck is this? Video memo recording, Agent 47023, Nam and Jaden, Tuesday, October 4th, 2011. Time is 8.14 a.m. What on earth am I wielding? Seriously, what the heck was that? Can I put them on? Let's keep them on. I'm curious. Now, can we walk with it? Oh, what on earth was that? Oh, here we go. Seriously, I am so confused. Bank manager... Dude, if, if unrelated to the investigation, if the FBI, FBI really has something I'm like this, for Lieutenant Carter Blake, that would be creepy. 
Oh, there he is. Let's go talk to him. He pointed this way, right? Uh, yeah, over here, I'm assuming the guy without the... Oh, we got something here. The guy Every without the reflective no vest is what I was trying to say. On the See, I don't like this, man. That creeps me out that if there is technology like this. Okay, so let's go talk to Officer Blake, which I assume is right here. Lieutenant Blake? I'm Agent Norman Jaden from the FBI. I went by your office this morning. They told me to be here. Now, if you're looking for rain, dead bodies, and highways, you come to the right place. Mike, will you tell that asshole with the bulldozer to stop for five minutes? I can't hear myself think here. Right away, Lieutenant. Well, are you coming, Jaden? So, what happened? Some guy taking his dog for a piss found a body about 6 o'clock this morning. We don't know much more right now. Based on what we've seen, looks like the work of the origami killer. Has the body been identified? No, not yet. We should know more later today. Any news on the coroner? He's on his way, Lieutenant. I'm not gonna lie, I find this a very for weird hour for fuck's game sake. to LP because it's very in depth. Do we know the cause of death? So I do apologize if there, are there no marks on the body. seems to be are he was moments of awkward silence. Like the it's uh, Cause the time of death really because I'm trying to pay attention, and I do apologize Based for talking over this, but there is uh, six hours ago. We oh should God. know more once the coroner oh has had a look. There are subtitles, so there are a lot of people on the crime scene. Aren't you afraid your men might destroy some clues? You don't find proof sitting behind a desk. We're not in the habit of trampling things into the ground, even if we're not in the FBI. Oh, this guy doesn't seem no, to like me no, at all. No, of course not. That's that's not what I meant. Tony, I don't want to see a single shit-stirring journalist within a mile of here. You got it? Yes, Lieutenant. I kind of have a weird face, don't I? Any witnesses? None yet. Given the neighborhood, I'd be surprised if anybody saw anything. Why are we walking Listen, all over the place? It's awkward, here. man. Why don't we discuss all this a little later, back at the office? Oh, no problem. I understand. Do you mind if I have a look around? Be my guest. All right, let's hey, use the new Jayden. alien technology that I've never even heard of. Anything, okay? We're on the same team now. Whoa. You don't make that, that little indication like you want to shoot me, my friend. I'm the FBI. Yo, don't mess with me. Ah, what is this? Oh. Harry comment. Sample of no interest. Comes from one of the policemen present on the wasteland. Wait, what? what? The hell was that? Like urine or something? Okay, well, let's back up over here. We'll take another quick little scan dealy bop. And we'll just walk around like I don't have any technology. Just joking. I have magical powers that can find DNA samples. What the heck was that? Why was I, like, tripping balls for a second then? That made no sense. Oh, here we go. Some orchid pollen. The concentration of pollen in the air is quickly decreasing because of the rain, but it gets higher in the direction of the body. It's higher in the direction of the body. Which is over here? Holy crap, there's Every lots of freaking samples over here. Pollen disappear in the tall grass probably the end of the trail. Alright, so let's quickly check what this is. It's probably another freaking... Harry, comment. Yeah. Traces of blood on the railroad track. Oh, that's blood. The blood report indicates an advanced and long-lasting state of exhaustion. I like how I could tell this with doing some sort of weird radar scan. Footprints, Footprints. continue just after the pollen trail. There's a good chance that they're the killers. Well, where do they lead? Like, go back. I'm trying to take a look at the footsteps. Now... They continue over this way. But we're not actually... Oh, we are able to walk up it. Ah, what is this? Here we go. I assume I can go to it? 
There we go. Oh. Very common. Traces of blood detected on the fence behind the railroad line. See, can I go up it? There we go. Oh, oh. Jesus! Really, buddy, you can't climb up a little hill? Alright, there you go. Come on! You can do it! I believe in you! You can do it! It may be ra Frig! No! Okay, we'll try one more time here. We'll try one more time. Circle. I got circle. Triangle. I got triangle. Man, this is all awkward as fudge. And then X. We got the X. And we got square. There we go. Now, that wasn't that hard. Now, was it? Oh, my God. We got more to go up. 